What is up guys, JJ Andrew from Druid Syndicate, bringing you a how to install video for my UI version 4. Big shout out to Mr. Incredible 2010 for just letting me know. So here we go, how to install. Go ahead and go to the link in the description. It's going to lead you to this page, my UI Galaxy Nexus. Go ahead and scroll down. Everything is working except for bugs that you guys find out. So basically, if you find a bug, go ahead and make an XDA account, XDA account and go ahead and tell them what bugs you have, or tell me and I'll try to tell them. But uh, yeah, go ahead and download this, and it's going to appear right on the bottom left if you're using Google Chrome. Looks like it's going to take about 10 minutes, maybe 15 going up to 20. Uh, this doesn't look good. Um, going up to 30 now. So, I don't know what's happening. This isn't very good. I'll be right back, guys. Okay, here we go. I canceled the download and retried. So as you can see, it is now at 10 minutes. So that's always nice. Now, I wonder if you guys actually know what MyUI is. MyUI is a ROM that has a really nice iOS look to it. And it combines all the nice iOS polished look with Android. So it is pretty much... Um, as I just described, the best ROM in the world. Uh, not speed-wise, though, and battery life-wise. I mean, like, the battery life is not good on my UI ROMs, in my experience, on my past my UI phones. But, yeah. So, um, go ahead and download that and push that file to your Galaxy Nexus. And once that is on our Galaxy Nexus, you can continue on to the next step, which is about to happen right now. Okay, so now that you have my UI ROM on your internal SD, go ahead and unlock your device. Go ahead and power off. Let's go ahead and power off, and I'll be with you guys once my phone is powered off. Okay, so here we go. Our phone is now powered off. Now what you're going to want to do now is hold on up button and down button while holding your power button. So make sure you're holding both of your volume buttons down and your power button and it's going to boot us into fast boot mode. Now in fast boot mode you're just going to click up two times and press power. So that's going to bring us into our recovery and I'll be with you guys once we're in our recovery. Okay so here we are in our recovery. Now, you don't have to, but if you do want to, you can make a backup right now. If you want to make a backup, you're just going to scroll down to Backup and Restore and click up Backup. Okay, so here we are at our recovery. We're just going to go ahead and wipe data, factory reset. So wipe your data. Shouldn't take that long. Depends, really. Doesn't really matter how much you have on your phone. It's really... Um, system-wise, see some nice angles on my phone there. I really like the design they did on this phone. It's sort of, I don't know. Okay, data wipe complete. Now we can go down and wipe cache partition. Go ahead and wipe your cache partition. That's gonna pretty much wipe uh, sort of all that saved data we have that we uh that the data wipe couldn't do. So let's say passwords, you know, like automatic stuff, it's gonna wipe all that stuff. Next thing we wanna do is scroll down to advanced, wipe Dalvik cache. Yes, wipe Dalvik cache. That takes no time at all. Now what you're gonna wanna go to do is install zip from SD card, choose zip from SD card, and go to that folder, or maybe you just threw it in there, Go to where that myui.zip is. Mine was in my download folder, and looks like it's right here. Go ahead and press yes. Install myui version 4. And I'll be back with you guys once myui is installed. Okay, so here we are. The install is complete. Now what you can do is go back and simply reboot system now. That is going to reboot into myui version 4. Congratulations. You will now have my favorite ROM on your phone. And I'll be back with you guys once the boot up is finished. Just kidding, I changed my mind. This is actually a pretty cool boot up and I want to show you guys this. Um, I don't know, myui.us and looks like there's a little guy 
wearing a wearing sort of like a I don't know what that is it's sort of like a Elmer Fudd hat I guess you could say and he looks like he has a little red handkerchief I don't know if you can see that it's sort of bright in here let me sort of shade it in should be able to see it a little bit easier now I'm trying to let you guys see it sorry I've almost too much lighting in here oh you can see a good view from there sort of not really <laughs> yeah um this looks like an actual I don't know this is pretty cool my UI always has their own twist on boot up animations now boot up what am I saying okay so my UI uh, has lots of customization options probably the most customization options on any ROM available uh, it has themes it has a wide range of themes it has a wide range of customization abilities in the launcher itself and overall it just looks great I mean like I can't really explain until I show you right now okay so here we are my UI it looks like we have the Nexus live wallpaper um, the lock screen is actually different so oh this is very cool this is okay this is amazing Okay, so when you click on it, it vibrates, and then you have a selection to go to camera, messaging, phone, or just unlock it. So that is really cool. Looks like we actually get a uh, super user right up there. Uh, my UI home. We want my UI home. Okay, so looks like right up here. Oh, that's cool. So we have, okay, that that's just awesome. Looks like we have 3G and 1G. That's sort of weird. Uh, 3G and 2G, I don't know what the 1X stands for. Uh, that, that's, that's pretty sweet. Uh, okay, so here's the home screen. We basically have all of these icons and stuff. And our notification bar is pretty sweet too. We have toggles. And yeah, I'm really excited for reviewing this ROM. That's what I'm going to do right after this video. So yeah, guys, the review will be in the description once I make it, of course. And yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Give me some feedback. Give it a thumbs up. I work hard on these pretty much every day. I post like, what, two or three videos a day now? Uh, so yeah, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all later in the review.